Polisi wabere take au. Totunula muna ula bejife Syria. Do you know what it takes when a country goes back to zero? To rebuild it. Uba auroza. Ekela bukeze encha ne dao. Do you see what is happening to Libya now? Bakenda miaka kumi nebi likumpi. Nothing. Omulibia ya lita sabanga kukati ya jaa sabana asaira mu Uganda. Because this goon thinks for him he can send people by creating anarchy. Yeye kweke taki mbwa seeking asylum. No. No. No, it is unacceptable that a goon sits in Turkey. Hey, chidi ayo chokera. Hey, mbanyi, bwe mwa ayo, akarube kana kwa, mochevi zimbe biyona. That goon. Mochevi zimbe biyona, muli mwe chicho chiriwa. For them, they think, nte, ajaku ture. Do you know when you incite violence, who the losers can be, including yourself? It is indiscriminate. We can have differences. Don't call for sectarianism. Let's think, think of a broad Africa. African nene. I remember one time, and Isma will testify. Yajawan, Namuga Isma, Sidanga, Yokuri Rango, Vumavan. He can go on his life and say it. Namuka, why do you have to insult Bobby Wine's family? I told Isma, why? Why? Chikuyamba chimu politiko kari yayo. Oku insultinga mchara omu. Tuomu lala naba nabe. I warned him. Do not do that. It's wrong. Even if you disagree with them. Tell them your disagreement. But do not insult them. And he knows it. And in Namugamba, first, don't, better not talk about me. Join those that insult other people. He knows it. Ask him and let him make a live against such Mugamba. I told him, I don't associate with people that insult others. I don't. So, Ebion Bibabu did it. But now Uganda, Boba Mani, a dance a chen president, Chim. I don't know. Probably it's his fake papers that he has been running around with, touting. First they said he was kidnapped, then they said it's police. So, Boba Badeba running it up propaganda all the time and trickery, and then they will implicate even their friends. Today they will say it was under Mandaku. Idiots! Tomorrow they will say, Nti oba ono, oba richi, oba someone. Idiots, because they don't understand. We are 45 million of people of Ugandans right now, but they are suffering because of the cocoon of, of individuals. We are suffering because of the now, these thugs, and I want to be very clear in my language, these goons and thugs, who others want to consider some hypocrites, some bigots, who have been promoting hate speech, some hooligans who have been promoting destruction. Bajikozi Sanga campaign that on their way to build their own political muscle, they should destroy others, their families and friends. Now, this thug who has been incarcerated in Turkey, 
Gwabai tarumbu ye is a goon, he's a thug, and I'll repeat it a million times. Bazi mbakakun of bigots who are going around using social media to preach hate speech and incite others against others is unacceptable. So, for those political hypocrites who are running around in Bubagi and Akuemba says Zensi Nezimu, Okuzigam and this thug who calls for the death and the murder of other people. And this is a political activist, human rights political activist. My food. These are not human rights political activists. These are goons, these are thugs, these are bigots that are going around preaching hate speech, hiding behind fake accounts to insult other people. Now, there is tremendous proof. In Tibaco's fake accounts, they started a hate campaign in Timugende Muvuma about on social media. I can tell you, you've made all insults against me. Whereas I don't wish that you be extradited, but I want you to know that one day you're going to be accountable. For those acts of Adovayo, Nori Mbirida Abantu, Nemuvuma Banamwe, Nemuvora Banamwe, Nemuvora Makagawe, and now, Ababa de Baba sponsoring, they are bigots. Ababa de Mabiga sponsoring these people. Babu Deo, Katonda Yagamba, Ntibobo Yagaro Kuraba, Shaitwani Eva de Mabiga Womundu, Jikone Ko, Ojakuraba Kuaba Damu Gerida. You can see all those that have posted are the people that have been supplying fake information, supporting the supply of fake information. Through this, and I can assure you, if you're saying you want to share everything, we've dissected everything. And their backers, you've seen their backers. You've seen their backers. Now they are coming out to call them political activists. These idiots that have been preaching sectarianism, they have been preaching hate speech. And you say you're going to go to foreign countries and say these are the right years people? Because they think they have monopoly over opposing the government. We can all oppose, but oppose respectfully. Oppose respectfully. You must know your lips and bounds. And for sure we shall pass a law. I can assure you, you can run however far you run. You'll pay. Nzechesi Kanyanacho is imprisoning them. They must pay for the damage they have caused. Because, you know, innuendo zebakora, ne propaganda kwebakora, damages someone. That is why anyone who publishes anything false must pay from their pocket. Their publications or utterances, zihatingabalala, so they must pay. And the law must come on electronic bullying. They may think they... Someone thinks, Yekwe said Dubai, it's too far. It's not too far. If a judgment is passed against you and ex parte, the court in any country can enforce it. And that's what they forget. I can sue you, Nebova Toriwano, and the courts enforce the judgment against you. Jory! They don't want to think. So th these thugs hide behind computers to think they'll intimidate people. No way. We are unintimidatable. What has he done for the country? Just in, sitting behind Kasaruni Katuram, that fugitive who ran to Turkey. Funny, funny fugitive ran to Turkey. is a fugitive. If he knew he had gone to Turkey in 2016, why didn't he seek asylum in 2016? What way are you amunonya? Everyone knew about that called a money exchange, money changer. No, 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 no. Don't think everyone is going to be bullied and everyone is going to be intimidated. There must be leaps and bounds. I have the right to kuso nyua ngomuntu. But you have no right to go and insult people's families. Even if Museveni has a problem, 
I have no right to go and insult his late grandmother or his mother or his child. Unless we are in the public domain. Ne ina auto ina right emu insulting. Go into a logical argument. Omu gai chino chewa koze chichamu. Chino chewa gambi e chitufu. You come and insult naba gere kangabu o yagara. Mbo yagara nyoka baka angabu of mamu chara we. Omanyi yagara obu waka baka angu kera no of mamu chara we. No of maba nabe. These thugs need to be put to order. They are pretenders. Are hiding are behind the wolf's sheep. And now you've known they are backers. Those that have posted him, calling him a human rights activist, are the same hypocrites that we are telling him to insult you. They have been behind all these insults because the, bene the beneficiaries of these insults were them. You have the right to belong to your party, even if it's no OFDC or DP. You have no right to insult me for not belonging to your party. You have no right to belittle anyone for not thinking the way you think. The only blame Jemba Ganti, the president was enjoying their music until they attacked him. For as long as it's above my age, it's okay. When they started abusing him. But you should see, the justice we should be calling for is that whenever someone insults the other, they must pay a price for insulting the other. And for me, security is imprisonment. No, we should find them. You insult me, you pay 200 million. Of Momurarosa Surenda Rabibidi, you fail to pay, we take your property, we attach it. That is the best law. You post someone's pictures without their authority. You pay. On your page, you pay. And by the way, Katitu just will have a fake account because all the information now lifts it. You can no longer hide. And you'll be very shocked right now evidence in court. Because wherever you are, there is what they call the God's eye. Bakuraba buwebat. Nebo jako muzindaro. Nebo okorachi. They can hear in whatever you say. So, whereas we stand out right, lo konde mingaba antu waba kuatida abantu obwele. And we did it. We also condemn those that spread falsehood, that have intentions of promoting genocide. Why Rwanda has been stable? They have a law. And the law is the law. If you make utterances aimed at promoting genocide, there is no country that is going to give you a safe haven. It's United Nations. So whatever you can say, this video, and I will play it, is incriminating whether they want it or not. These two thugs, these two thugs, ah, human rights activists. You hear this idiot talking about Rwanda? You mean in Rwanda they were laughing? Listen. We are 45 million of people of Ugandans right now, but they are suffering because of the cocoon of, of individuals. Yeah. And the goon comes out and says, and his hypocritic backers, that this is a political activist. Shame on you. Shame on you. While you are every now and then, they were hiding away.
And this is what he said. These are his words. These are not my words. So, Abantubali Kuno, Musonywe. What had debate numbers done to his school? They said these things in 2019 and they thought the records would not be there. We have even a lot of their communications and by the way we decided to keep quiet some of us because we don't have time for this. But when hypocrites come out and start saying that this one is a political activist. He is not a political activist. He has written his information based on falsehood, insults, innuendos, ngavuma kabaka, avuma royal family, avuma other political activists, avuma everyone in Uganda, backed by his hypocrites, who have been supplying him with money. For me, I don't want to care how he's in Turkey. That's up to him. Because Turkey, he's not right. He's their guest. If they want him there for asylum, that's up to them. But we must call AA and BB. It is the final channel being there, no? I'm out.